Glenda Hallowell had no idea what her home would really cost her when she put in an offer. Did you feel a pressure to put in an offer right away? From my agent, I did, yes. And what did your agent tell you? My agent told me that it was a great house, great price. If I didn't buy it, he would. Just to be sure, she got a home inspection. Her real estate agent recommended someone. I know the um, home inspectors can't see through walls, but he knew that the cracks and the purging and the bloating and everything meant that there was water seepage. But you didn't know? I didn't know that. And when I asked him about it, he says, oh, it's nothing, don't worry about it. And I was told it was a turnkey house that also I had to do was move in, unpack. Trusting it was all okay, she bought the home, but it didn't take long to find out something was wrong. The first time I tried to spend the night in the basement and I woke up in the morning, my chest felt heavy, my eyes were swollen shut and crusty having trouble breathing because of the mold down there that I was told there wasn't any. Not only was there mold, but nearly $100,000 worth of required repairs. I lifted up the floor to see what was going on underneath, and the floor was like mud. Hallowell took the inspector and the real estate agent to court. She won. The building inspector was found 100% liable for failure to adequately warn and explain uh, his visual findings uh, and to make sure that um, his client understood the implication of those findings. I was happy that I won because then I could fix it because if I had lost I couldn't fix it. I didn't have the money to do any of the repairs. So this passed inspection did it? I don't think so. Celebrity contractor Mike Holmes is often called in to make it right when things with a house go wrong. He says it's easy for prospective home buyers to miss signs of trouble if they're not prepared. The very first thing that you need to do is really simple. Find the home inspector and the best home inspector you can find before you look for a house. Never do it the other way around because odds are it can hurt. But I would take a contractor through it as well and really do due diligence. In the bathrooms where there's tubs surround, press against the wall, because I found out later there was no wall behind the tubs surround, it had rotted away.